This new GAL has all kinds of save me from death and destruction features. I mean, hill descent, ABS, backup camera, and now proximity warning sensors in the taillights. How does that even work? What if I drive into a wall? Will it stop me? Nope. How about backing into some guy that parked too close behind me? Will it stop me from plowing into his ride? Nope. Okay, so what happens if another Jeeper, with a great sense of humor, parks very close to me? Go ahead and back it up, Dennis. Go ahead and back it up. It won't go? It won't go. Never fear, you're protected. You cannot hit the offending wall, pole, jeep, rock, or whatever it is. It just puts it to neutral. It says, it says proximity warning and it won't let it go. This new JL will instantly protect itself and you by going into neutral and removing any and all ability you once had to move the You're jeep. You're doing it! There it goes, quits moving. Forward or reverse? and then it won't let it back up. Sure, you can move it an inch or so, but that's it. Back to neutral. Now, it starts to go, now it goes to neutral. It's like you're gonna hit your Jeep, don't move, dude. Cycle the key, shift forward to reverse. No bueno. Shift to neutral and push. Yeah. We did it! That'll work, as long as you put the transfer case in neutral. But when your wife calls and lays into you for buying a Jeep that won't even move, just have her shift into four low. Four low overcomes the proximity system and allows you to once again move the Jeep and to run into random things until your heart's content. Just here to help. Be careful out there.